Hey guys, so another of our, our Pagan Opinions finishing up series thing. Got this video and got the next video and that will be the last video of the questionnaires um, videos. And I hope that this kind of helps complete some bit of on my behalf, complete of the season. I've been pondering about it and I was like, ah, oh, this is sad because it's one of my, it was my, one of my favorite, favorite, favorite collab channels that I ever worked with. Um, it was really the good runnings and it had had its it thing and now it's and I kind of want to revive it back so hopefully this doesn't stop with the whole questionnaire videos and my opinions and and uh, question you guys I hope that you guys are not scared to message me any at any of these uh, venues through YouTube through through Twitter through Facebook, um, just message me anywhere with a question and I would be happy, happy to make a video for you, personally for you and give you my information and, and give you kind of like my opinions into it. So this will be <laughs> week nine. Um, how do you use dream work in your practice? Not really big in dream works. I think it's one of one of my many weaknesses into the craft. I think it's the least knowledge of my craft that I know. Um, besides, just like simple, have a journal and a pencil, or have pen and paper right next to you as you're waking up. Um, my basic information is um, when you wake up, you have the first like five or ten minutes to remember your dream. So I jot down as much as keywords, sentence, uh, paragraphs. Sometimes draw a picture, imagery throw it on there and um, figure it out kind of later in the day and kind of like sort your of brain out and then come home from a whole days of work, whatever, come home and then realizing, you know, researching, figuring it out. Um, that's pretty much it. When it comes to dreamology and the dream dictionaries, this be the very first thing I run to and look through. I don't have a lot of uh, knowledge into it, but it is part of my craft, but it's the least one of the least part of my craft and it's sad because it kind of makes me want to get into DreamWorks. So that being said, maybe this video will just bring confidence in me to get off my lazy bed, which I'm sleeping, and get into the craft, the dream craft, the dreamology. So um, if you guys have any information or any ways that you do your dream works, um, or dreamcraft or dreamology, whatever you want to call it. What do you do with your dreams? And do you research them? Do you go online? Do you kind of have your own dictionary? What would be it? Leave the comments down below. And like always, thank you for subscribing, commenting, liking, and whatnot. So till then, what's it?